I don't know. It's hand sanitizer. Look at that. And it lights up. It's a lot of hand sanitizer, but you know what? It's fine. Good evening, everyone. Today we'll be going over words that are hard to pronounce. First, there's going to be a definition, then there's going to be the word. I will try to pronounce that word. I will then paste that word into Google Translate to see if I pronounced it correctly, because Google is 100% correct. Always trust the internet. Anyways, a place that knows not of cities. Oh, And the word is um, rural, rural, rural. I think I did that. R rural. It's like royal, but it's rural. Google says rural. There you go. Next definition. Dry wheat cracker. Uh, are most crackers made of wheat and dry? Wow. Wow. You think you're funny, don't you? Wheat thins. It's not called wheat thins, it's called wheat thins. This isn't Family Guy, this is real life. Anyone who says otherwise is wrong. It's wheat thins. Have Google tell you. Ready? Wheat thins. Wheat thins. Boom. Number three. Not whipped cream. Well, what is it then? Nice. Nice. Cool whip. It's not cool whip, it's cool whip. Cool whip. Cool whip. Like cool whip. Cool whip. Say it with me. Cool whip. Cool whip. This is fun. <laughs> Number four. We got not rice. What the? F what is it then? What is it? Kanoa? Quinoa. Quinoa. That's... I can't believe I read that and was like, quinoa? Quinoa. Quinoa. There you go. This is actually really easy so far. Number five. It isn't ice cream, it's DiGiorno. <laughs> that wasn't funny. Sherbert? Oh, <laughs> that's like that's a nod to the uh, previous video I made. And sherbet. Excuse me. Sherbet. Sherbet. It's sherbet. Sherbet. Moving on, head, shoulders, knees, and toes, but mainly ears and throat. Wow, that was actually kind of, that was kind of good. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes, but mainly ears and throat. 
I like that. That's I like that. That's good. Oh, that's scary. I don't like you. Or oh, this this is when it gets tricky. Ortho ortho allergist. Ortho like yeah no. Nope. Google, you're gonna have to help me out here, cause I don't. Uh, it's too much, too much for me. Oh, a rhino laryngologist. I heard rhino. That's all I need to know. I heard rhino. You're gonna hear, folks. It's rhino. Rhino doctor. Good luck. Lucky. So I know for, like, I know 100% I can never pronounce this word correctly. So, uh, good luck, yeah. War Worcestershire sauce. Worcestershire. 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 Yeah, I don't know. Let's just see what Google says because I'm not going to try anymore. Not gonna do it. I just, I just can't. I'm done with that word. I want it to be removed from the dictionary. It shouldn't even be a thing. It really shouldn't. It's like a what brown sauce? Worcestershire sauce. That has no reason to be in the English dictionary. Be gone. Finding Nemo's home. Inon. Enimon. 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 Animon. Animon. That sounds like a Pokemon. Go! Animon! I choose you! I'm so sorry. Anemone. There's only one right way to say this. Excuse me? Okay, I believe 100% that there is two ways. It, it depends on situation. You got data, you got data. That there's two ways to say it. There's two. There's not one. There's two. Well, how does Google say it? Data. It's not data. It is data or data. There. Here. What about what about that? Does that do anything? Data. Son of a... Next word. There's only one right way to say it. Is this gonna be like out of data? Really. Really? Caramel. But it is pronounced caramel. I say caramel because I don't know, I grew up saying that, but it's pronounced caramel. 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 I already hate this. Alright, Google, what do you say? Do you agree with me? Caramel. Caramel? Caramel, caramel. Where, where's the mole part? This says mel. If I were to like... Mel. Not, then it's not caramel, it's caramel. Google, you're failing me. Boo? Ah. Uh, that's gonna be all for tonight. Well, if you enjoyed that, please like, consider subscribing, commenting. Oh, uh, comment to, comment down below what words you can pronounce. I am curious. And uh, maybe they'll be featured in another one if I want to ever do this as a series. Well, see you guys in the next one.